Netcasts you love. From people you trust. This is Twit. Hello, my name is Chad. I'm with Twit and Before You Buy. And today I am reviewing the Samson Go Mic Direct. Uh, it's this bad boy. Just to not give you the false impression, I'm using this microphone to capture my voice right now, not this microphone. The Samson Go Mic Direct is a small USB mic that you can plug into the side of a laptop. I currently have it plugged into my tower PC with an extender that they don't supply. This is my own extender. The mic is pretty small, about two inches by two inches by I'd say about three quarters of an inch uh, thick. It has a swivel microphone head, so you can point it sort of in uh, any direction. And it also has LEDs on the back and on the front to give you a little bit of an idea if you're peeking out the micro, if you're peeking out the microphone. If you talk too loud, uh, this will turn red and give you an uh, an idea if the microphone is peaking and being too loud. So I'm gonna give a little product demo. Uh, I have three microphones plugged in and hooked into my recording software right now, recording simultaneously. First is the High LPR40, which you've heard me on so far. Next is the Samson Go Mic Direct. And you can tell that it is a little bit more roomier. My voice does sound okay, but you can hear the fan in my computer that's running right next to me. Uh, this claims for noise cancellation, it doesn't if it does do noise cancellation, it doesn't do uh, an awful lot. Next, I also have the built-in microphone that is in the webcam that I'm using to capture my video. So you can just get an idea between the webcam mic and the Samson Go Mic direct mic, just to get an idea between the two differences if you were to say just use the microphone built into your webcam. Who would buy this device? Well, Samson says on their box, perfect for Skype, FaceTime, YouTube videos, and more. I don't really agree with the YouTube videos. I don't think anyone's gonna take you seriously with this type of mic. You would have to spend a little bit more in order to get a higher quality microphone. But for Skype and FaceTime, if you're trying to get over, say, a internal microphone built into your laptop that isn't very good quality, that maybe people can't hear you, this seems like a great alternative. I've sometimes run into really bad microphones built into laptops, and this is only $40, so for a small upgrade, if you need to do a conference call, having this in your backpack to plug into your laptop that you know the mic is bad in would actually be a, the perfect use for the Samson Go Mic Direct. Pros and cons. Pro is that it is small. Another pro is that it has a retractable USB. And another pro is that it does give you an LED readout when this is peaking. On the cons, noise cancellation, eh, not so great. Quality is not, I would say, at a professional level, which I wasn't really expecting in this small of a microphone. And my final con is that this has to be plugged in to the left side of your computer. The swivel action doesn't go all the way around, so if it was plugged in the other way, you could actually point it at your mouth. Finally, the Samson Go Mic Direct is about uh, $40 online. MSRP is higher, but I'm finding it for about $40 just about everywhere. And in the box, it does come with a small carrying case, which is padded for the Samson Go Mic, which is, which is kind of a nice feature. Buy, try, don't buy for the Samson Go Mic Direct. I'm gonna give this a buy. The quality isn't the best, but also it's only $40. And if you're trying to upgrade from the built-in microphone inside of your laptop, this is kind of the perfect solution. It's small, it's portable, and it is easy to use. Thanks so much for watching my review of the Samsung Go Mic Direct. I have, have been Chad, <laughs> the whole video long I've been Chad, for Trit and before you buy, and I'll see you next time.